Hello makeup lovers, welcome back. Today I have a new Rockin' Mid product review. This is also titled The Taylor Made Me Buy It because I don't know if you guys know but I've mentioned before in previous videos that I love The Taylor on YouTube. She is a, a makeup guru and she's just awesome. I love her personality and she does all kinds of great reviews on products so there's been a few things she's mentioned that well, a couple of things that she's mentioned that, you know, have made me want to buy it and I've actually bought it and now I love these products. So I wanted to share that with you guys and give her credit for making me buy stuff because that's not easy. <laughs> I tend to be very skeptical about gimmicks in people promoting stuff. So I always really just try to do a lot of research and I don't trust people easily. So that's why. Anyhow, let's get started with this. So I'm going to start with the very first product that the Taylor that she mentioned and I love it i've been using it and i absolutely love it and it is this astic secret clay it's indian healing clay mask so this one you get it on amazon and i think it cost me like 16 dollars but this is a lot this is so much product you get in here it's like it's heavy and you get so much and you only need like a tiny bit to use on your face I like to mix it with some apple cider vinegar, which I've heard is the best way to use it for pulling out gunk <laughs> from your pores. So this one does feel like it tightens your skin. As you feel it dry, you feel it tighten, and it's supposed to clean your pores. It's just supposed to be really, really, really good for you. And I really love it. This one, is definitely something I will keep repurchasing and using because I have found it to be awesome. So this rocks along with uh, mix it. You can mix it with water. It I prefer to mix it with uh, the vinegar, which doesn't make it smell great, but it doesn't matter. Okay, next product that the Taylor made me buy <laughs> is this uh, Wet n Wild Matte liquid lipstick and don't be a plum plum. I saw her wear it in one of her videos and I was like, oh my gosh, what color is that? It is absolutely beautiful. And she lists out the products that she uses on her description box. So I saw it and I'm like, oh, I gotta have it. So I went to Walgreens and bought my own and I love this. I used it once on my lips and I absolutely love it. It looks beautiful, but I love to use it on my eyebrows. It's usually, you've seen it, I've worn it before and I use it a lot to fill my brows. And it's just a gorgeous, go gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. It's a gorgeous color. Let me just, and the formula is great too. The, the wand looks a little bit frayed, but it's really not a big deal. So this is the color or how it looks in this light. I absolutely love it. And I'll use it on my brows, which is one of my favorite ways to use it. So this rocks. Thank you, the Taylor. <laughs> now moving on to things that I have purchased on my own just because I like to look for new things. I was looking for a new face wash and I was trying to look for a cruelty-free type product better than like all the others that seem to just have these random chemicals that I'm just like, okay, what am I putting on my face? And I found this Desert Essence Cleanser in my grocery store. And it's a thor thoroughly clean face wash. Okay, this has like no animal derived ingredients, no parabens, no artificial fragrances, no petroleum compounds, including mineral oil, petroleum, uh, petrolatum, and paraffin. It's got a lot of no's on here. <laughs> no glycols or phthalates. This is cruelty free. You can see, oh, let me see. Can you see it? Is it too bright? It's cruelty free. It smells like a plant, but it is awesome. I am in love with this. Well, not in love, but I love this face wash. 
it leaves my skin feeling so clean and it just oh, it is a great product it cost me how much did it cost i think it cost me 12 dollars at my grocery store but it is absolutely worth it you get 8.5 flowing ounces of this product and i use it twice a day and i've been using it for a month and i've only used this much you just need one pump one pump and it washes off all your makeup it leaves you your skin feeling squeaky clean like literally like nothing has ever made my skin feel this clean and not left it like just dry and tight i love this product the the, the scent of it is not my favorite but it's not like bothersome to where you're like ugh, you know you just kind of wash your face and and do your thing but this rocks another product i found at sally beauty supply when i was buying hair dye i decided to try it i was curious about it and this is a pore refining uh, cleansing peeling gel you know i'm usually iffy about stuff like this but i figured i would try it it was eight dollars and i bought it and this is awesome too i like to use this in the shower after i wash my face and it's nice and clean i'll go with the gel and then you just massage it and as you massage it you can feel like little i think it's the skin and i know there's another company that came out with something similar like this before that was really really expensive this one's only eight dollars and it does the same thing and i have noticed in the texture of my skin that it's become like smoother and not as you know bumpy like i've always had um, a lot of bumpiness and i used to break out in a rash i don't know i had some kind of reaction so it left texture on my skin and this has been helping with that texture like i could feel the skin like you could feel little bits of it like coming off i don't know if it's like just the surface stuff goo that you have <laughs> but this works it's awesome i love it i love 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 it rocks rocks yeah next product Okay, these, this is gonna be like a group. This is from ColourPop, and I went and bought three eyeshadows from ColourPop because I've been wanting to try them. I've heard a lot of good things, and of course I wanted to try them for myself, right? So these are, ooh, I'm gonna drop them. They're $5 a pop, ColourPop. <laughs> Such a dork. All okay, right, so I bought these three colors because I'm in love with like red tones burgundy tones and then this one just caught my eye because it's so sparkly so let's swatch this one first the sparkly one this is called i heart this can you see that i heart this like literally i heart this okay so if you've never tried these these eyeshadows they're they have like a creamy um gel like consistency i have stuff in my hand already and they are they're not hard to work with though they feel a little wet they're not dry so there's I heart this look at that it's beautiful like really really beautiful and then there's Beverly which is this darker uh, I want to say darker burgundy color <laughs> And they do feel like gels or like a creamy. It looks darker in the pot than it actually applies, but you can build it up. See? Oh, it's. I love it. I love these eyeshadows. And then there's Paradox, which I love the name. This is Paradox, which is, looks really, really red. I love red. I love red eyeshadows, my favorite. Can't find many good red eyeshadows, so that's one thing that's hard to find and like not spend a ton of money. There you go. See, that's Paradox. Isn't that gorgeous? Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. <laughs> I love it, I love this color. So these are beautiful. As you can see, they're very well pigmented. They have a gel-like consistency or like a wet consistency, almost spongy, it feels like. And they're easy to work with. I've used them several times and I love them. I will be purchasing more of their eyeshadows because they're beautiful, except that they are $5 each, you know, and then 
you have to do the whole, they only sell them online, so you do pay for, sh for shipping, which adds to the price. So little by little, I will be buying some more. And another thing I bought from ColourPop is their Ultra Satin Lip. And this is a gorgeous color. The texture of this liquid lipstick feels like the one from Kat Von D when you put it on. So they have like that same texture. This one doesn't fully dry ever. I wore it and I felt like it would it would transfer on everything that I you know like if I touched it, it would transfer on my lip on my finger on my coffee my coffee cup it would just transfer and but it's a beautiful color I actually used this for a Halloween look to draw little veins on my face and it's beautiful just you know set it with a translucent or with an eyeshadow on top if you want it to stay a little better because it does not dry. It's like a lipstick that you would wear, you know, like a stick that, you know, it transfers onto stuff. But I love it and it rocks. If you're not looking for something that stays, but is very well saturated, feels good on the lips and is beautiful, this, this right here, rocks. Let's go into some face creams, shall we? So I got these face creams in my Ipsy bag uh, what last month month before I don't remember and I remember mentioning that I did not like the smell of this guy but I used it anyway and I absolutely love the way it felt on my skin it is very emollient very thick it is very thick and I used the whole tube and it feels so good on the skin so good so I really liked it I don't know about you know rapid repair stuff like changing any kind of lines or stuff like that but it felt great, moisturized my skin. I like to use it at night. It was, it felt wonderful. So it rocks. Another one that I, this is the Clark's Botanicals Age Defying Radiance Cream. It's another one, I, I didn't go through this one as quickly, but I had to smell it for some reason. But I also enjoy using it. I'll use this one more for the daytime. It's a little bit lighter, so I liked it. It, it has like that natural scent too and I have nothing bad to say it doesn't feel heavy or anything like that it's just a light almost lotion like feeling so it rocks another cream I use a lot of creams <laughs> I don't know I have a thing for creams is this Derma E right Derma E I decided to buy it because it was on sale and I've been wanting to try their products. I've heard good things and I love this one. This is the anti-wrinkle vitamin A retinol palmitate cream and this feels like heaven on the skin. Let me tell you, you get a whole lot. It's, I mean, it costs $12 at my grocery store but I got it on sale at Walgreens and you get four ounces and you only need like a tiny bit for your whole face and neck and it feels like the silky, creamy, wonderful, I don't know what to call it, blanket on your face that you just want to keep massaging over and over and over and just feel it sinking into your skin. That is how this feels and I love it. So this rocks and if you're looking for something emollient and very uh, moisturizing, go for this guy. Last thing is this Indie Beauty Buttercream Antioxidant Lip Scrub that I got in my Ipsy bag and I absolutely ended up loving it. I will use it every once in a while. I don't use it every night, but it leaves my skin smooth and soft and I love it. So this rocks as well. Alright guys, well that is all I have for you today. I really hope you found something new that you might want to try. I suggest that you do. <laughs> oh, and for this mask I have Combination Skin. If you have combination skin or oily skin, this will be great for you. This one right here. Okay, so don't forget to give my video the thumbs up. And subscribe if you're not already part of the Makeup Artist Me Makeup Lovers. And as always, rock on!